what's up guys Michael Shope here and uh, yeah check out that view I would say I got incredibly lucky with that hotel anyway uh, yeah day 1b of EPD Capione is about to start so really fucking excited Let's do this! I'm here at the dinner break at EPT Campione on day 1B. I'm sitting now at like 60k and uh, really looking forward to play the last two levels and be done for today. Yeah, day 1B of EPT Campione is done. I have 58k. Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess I'm gonna cut this, but whatever. Um, yeah, I guess I didn't do much all day, actually. I made some pretty big net folds. Um, <coughs> he's king. <coughs> yeah. Uh, anyway, yeah. They're just, I don't know. I just feel like sometimes it's not a really good idea to overplay the day's king. It's a really nice hand, and I love it, but like, 150 big blinds? Uh, not for me. No, 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 no. Yeah, I don't know. I, with this field and, and the player caliber that was there... I mean, I think it's a spew to get it in, um, and I hate to just be flat calling with Ace King. I don't know if it's horrible, so folding seems like the best option. Um, on a different side note, I got a major present right before dinner break. It was a pretty funny hand actually. Um, action goes like this: UTG opens. It was like two four, and he makes it like twelve hundred or so. I have pocket kings, and I make a little bit flatty flatty. Um, yeah, I had my reasons, let's just put it that way, I'm obviously not always flatting, but against him and with the players behind me, and right before the break, I thought it was just a perfect spot to flat. A uh, small big blind over call 2, and the board comes down, ace, king, 7, all rainbow. And uh, under the gun guy decides to open shove 24 Ks into 4 Ks. Again, he ships into a 4K pot, 24 K straight. Um, yeah, that was just a massive present. I mean, I guess after I saw his hand, he would have played out kind of the same anyway by the river. He's not like getting away from ace queen ever, but um, yeah, he might get some value from my ace jacks or I don't know, whatever else I could be calling there with. But just open shoving is just thank you very much, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, that, that pretty much brought me to 60k, and from then on, I just cruised around, didn't play massive pots, didn't have really hands, like, no spots to take, and, yeah, here I am, 58k, off to day two. Before we make it to day two, check out the feature interview I had with Kevin Sivel van der Smissen. Kevin is a good buddy of mine and a pro at lock poker. I'll leave a link down in the description, check out his site. Yeah, let me know if you liked the interview and if you liked the entire video, give me a thumbs up or subscribe somewhere. I never know which side it is, you, you'll tell me. Just the subscribe button somewhere up here. So yeah, hit that and uh, see you guys soon. All right, Kevin, how are you doing today? Good, and you? <laughs> Great, how is poker going for you so far? It's been up and down, I've, I've started good, so I've gone to like 40k very fast and I kind of dropped to 15k without winning a hand the last two hours, but then I doubled up with 10s against 9s, where Eugene Cattle folded jack, so kind of running good in that way, so yeah. You also told me about another hand where you actually followed the set. Yeah. I've Are you turning into net now? Am I going to be no, worried about no, you? It's, 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 it's <laughs> I'm usually the guy that folds, not you. Yeah, but it's kind of so obvious that even I can fold it. So uh, I open like nines and a gun, big fish, three bits, uh, probably min three bits me. Mm -hmm. And some decent ish guy calls. Uh, I call obviously flop is nine, jack queen. I was like, nice, fist pump in my head. <laughs> so I check the other guy snap jams. I'm like, nice, but the other guy's like, all in. Like, fuck. <laughs> so I was like, I kind of snap folded, uh, snap folded in my head. And after five seconds, I fold it. It was a good fold because the other guy had jack, so and uh, the fish had 10 trees suited, so pretty fun. I funny. guess, yeah. How, how often have you ever folded a set so far? On the flop, it's probably my first time at life. <laughs> so. I, I guess it's the first time at any point for for you, I mean. <laughs> uh, maybe, yeah, it could be, I don't I know. Mean, I, I, don't I, tell I, me you folded a set ever unless the, I can't remember. the board is like, I don't know, four flush or like uh, one card straight. Uh, Probably, but I don't remember, so... Yeah. Alright, it's, it's good to like avoid the memories of folding sets, I agree. Yeah. 
Who wouldn't want to tomorrow, remember that? Tomorrow, I don't know if all the sets left. The sets <laughs> I have the same kind of memory. In like, Italy. Wow, where are my cards again? Last hand? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, so. <laughs> but yeah, all right. Well, cool, man. Good luck to you, Kevin, Thank in you. the next few levels. And, and actually, thanks. I kind of felt like I... Um, yeah, intruded here a little bit in getting the camera up front and be like, all right, what's up, Kevin? Yeah. <laughs> so sorry about that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, show me some more love.